French guy with us. So, I'm currently in Philadelphia Airport. I'm on my way to my next tournament, uh, St. Louis Open 12K. So this is back to the Challenger Tour, okay, yeah, where I'm number one this year. So I'll take you to this week and show you how I get on and what it's like on the Challenger Tour. I'm here, I've arrived in St. Louis. I'm. Uh, just about to go to the club for my afternoon hit. But before that, I'm doing a clinic with two junior group sessions. So I'll do that first and then, and then get some training in. Keeping it light today, had quite a busy week of practice matches in Philadelphia. Uh, so I just, just a light hit on the Sunday just to get the body moving. And then from tomorrow, uh, be all getting ready for the tournament. So So I'm here at the St. Louis Club, uh, just having my morning, afternoon hit on Sunday with Anthony Rogel. There you go. Just about to head into the club. Uh, we've got this weird French guy with us, and uh, I might put my billet Omar. Baptiste, how do you like the court here? They are pretty good. Uh, the ball is taking very, very, very tight to the side walls. So Curtis is struggling a bit. But we are going to move a bit more, so he's going to find a solution. I think. Yeah, uh, I think he's chatting a bit of rubbish, but we'll see. We've got Henrik and Alex uh, over there training as well. The back of the kill face on that left. Just finished our uh, morning hit, so just get some recovery in the. Uh, this is like an ice bath with bubbles. That's really cold. It's like three to five degrees. They said so. Stop. Okay, Baptiste, where are we now? We are at some golf practice here in Saint Louis, and uh, I'm going to show you because Curtis is not able to. How do we play golf? Right, let's have a look. See if you can get it more than the five yards you've averaged so far. Sure, where did that go? So this was the first ride. Oh, it's there. And then? <laughs> I'm here at the St. Louis Open. Uh, the golf tournament starts this week. My first round on Wednesday. Is it on the PGA Tour you're the playing? PGA Tour, yeah. yeah. Uh, Amazing. If you want to watch me do some of my practice swings, just yeah, here we go. I'm treating this is round one in the tournament. Yep. <laughs> yep. Yep. Uh, so that should get me moving 
nice. All right, so it's game day. Uh, I'm first on at 5 p.m. Baptiste, when are you on? Uh, just next, next after you, 6 p.m. 6 p.m. Yeah. yeah, so we're just getting into the club now. 40 minutes till I play. It's another lovely day here in St. Louis. So I'll give you an update after the match finishes. Okay, Curtis, tell me, tell us about your performance. Yeah, just managed to win three love against Eddie Charlton. Uh, I started off really well, and then I kind of back ended each game, lost a little bit of focus, let him back in, but he's a super experienced player. He had the home advantage with the crowd here, and yeah, I'm just pleased to get off in three games and close the last game out, because I lost a little bit of focus about eight, five. But yeah, it was good, on to the quarters tomorrow. Against? Either Jan Wipperfeff or Anthony Rogel. That's good pronunciation, thank you. So I've just got back to my Billet's house and they've kindly made me some dal, uh, sagaloo, some fresh uh, salad and some pilau rice. Just finished my quarterfinal match against Jan Vipperford. Managed to win three love. So I'm on to the uh, semi finals tomorrow against Mohamed Zakaria. So I'll let you know how I get on tomorrow. Baptiste, yeah. how was your match today? Uh, pretty tough. Uh, actually, I, I lost three love. But um, some, some good squash, hard squash. Um, he played well, I played well, he got the better of me this time, but yeah, next time is for me. Yeah, good effort, good luck in the next events. Thank you. Thank you.
How is it? Straight away, straight away. Uh, yeah, I'm, I just got the dog out of me and just grinded it through. It wasn't my best squash at the start. I was being a little bit tentative and then I just let my arm go a little bit and then managed to find some in holes and winners on the volley and stuff. So, class player for today, though. So. Well played, man. Well, I've just had my breakfast. Uh, <clears throat> today is finals day. I'm playing Spencer Lovejoy of USA uh, at 5 p.m. again. So this is the last big push. Body's feeling good after a tough battle yesterday, 90 minutes. So <clears throat> just gonna leave it all out there and yeah, see how well I can do. Baptiste is off back to France. How are you feeling? Uh, sad. It was uh, such a good week here. Uh, lovely meeting you, Curtis and yeah. uh, Omar and his family. I hope to be back soon. Uh, yeah, not everyone is lucky enough to be in the final, so... Yeah, yeah thanks for all the coaching this week. Uh, and uh, right. good luck in is it Johannesburg. Yeah, yeah, actually. Right. Right, so it's the morning after the final. Uh, so yesterday, I managed to win my eighth PSA title, which is which is great. I'm really happy to come through this week. Being top seed isn't always easy. The pressure's on you, and everyone else is out there gunning to beat you. And I'm, I'm also really happy because I had a tough week at the US Open, obviously losing first round. So to come out here in St. Louis and win four matches back to back. Uh, is is yeah, it's, it's really rewarding. Just want to say like a massive thanks to like my billets, Omar Malik and Farrell for hosting me this week. Uh, and then I want to thank all my sponsors, my family, and and everyone back home. And thanks for you guys for watching these videos. Uh, I hope you enjoy them. If you want to see more content like this behind the scenes of what we get up to on the PSA World Tour, then. Please like it, subscribe, subscribe to our channel and uh, share it around. Thank you. See you on the next one.